that's good stuff right there, baby. Last December, I, Fitness Junior, shocked the wrestling world when I went down to Dothan, Alabama, and I beat El Hijo de Blasphemia to become the American National Light Heavyweight Champion. As some of you may know, last week, I was stripped of the title when I failed to make weight. They said I was over the limit, 14 pounds. And you know what? That may be true. You know, I bulked up a little bit as I won that championship in the last few months. But there's more to this story than what meets the eye. You know, after Fitness 2 took me under his wing, I took his training serious. I cut down to a good slim trim 204 to try to become a champion. And I shocked the world when I won that light heavyweight championship. Nobody saw that coming. So to have it stripped from me is nothing more than an embarrassment. But let me tell you about the sacrifices I've had to make as I became champion. I've been training every day. Don't be fooled. Don't think I've been slacking in the gym. But old Fitness Junior, finally, for the first time in his life with that gold, came a little bit of money. I was just a poor little Fitness Junior for many, many years. Now I have some money in my pocket. And you know what? I can't control something. That's my love for fast food. And that's eating. All these times after the training, Fitness 2 and myself would go to the bar. I told him, hey, I'm going to sneak out for a quick cigarette. But really what I did was walk across the street and go to McDonald's so I could stuff a couple Big Macs and a Diet Coke down my face. There's a lot of stuff that goes on behind the scenes in this wrestling business. No longer can I stay at the original fitness's house. I can't even sleep on his couch no more. He's disowned me as I follow the path of fitness too. So here I am, a champion, living in my car. You want to see what I eat? It's right here, every day, day in and day out. A brown paper bag, McDonald's, Burger King, Big Macs, protein shakes, leftovers from the food pantry. Shit, I don't care. I can't stop myself. I've got an appetite right now. But the only thing stronger than my appetite for junk is smashing people's faces in. You see, I'm still not convinced. Yeah, I'm putting on the pounds. I'm eating all the food. But I'm training my ass off. My weight should not be that high. I think that scale, that scale was not balanced. And you know what? I'm demanding a, re a recount of my weight on a, with an official present to show where I'm at. Hell, even the gym we go to, their scale is off. Last week when I was stripped of the title, they said I was over the pound limit by 14 pounds. Today, it said I was 238. Fitness Junior's never been 238 pounds. Now, ha ha ha, whoa, you know what? I thought about quitting. I thought about taking the easy path. And that's joining the heavyweight ranks. But I'm a light heavyweight champion. That championship gave me more worth in my life than any other feeling I've ever had. More than eating a Whopper. More than a couple Big Macs. So in the next few weeks, not only am I going to prove that that scale was not balanced correctly, but you're going to see Fitness Junior in all of his best training as I slim back down. Because guess what? Coming up, Bentonville at the fairgrounds, Bentonville, Arkansas. There's an American National Light Heavyweight Tournament, and yours truly, Fitness Junior, is coming back to reclaim what is mine. Crown Championship Wrestling, go to their Facebook page and like it right now. You're going to see one of the best light heavyweight tournaments and Fitness Junior has a mean streak in him now. Longer than the streak in my underpants from all these milkshakes I've been having. <laughs> I'm going to rip off somebody's head. That American heavyweight, light heavyweight championship is coming on with me. And you'll see that I'm not messing around. Because Fitness is my name. Big Macs, 
SpaghettiOs, whatever the hell you got in your mama's fridge is my game. I'm coming down to Arkansas to take that light heavyweight championship back where it belongs. And I'll be walking out of there two-time American National Light Heavyweight Champion. <laughs>